Among combat sports, the Professional Fighters League is unique and innovative. Athletes earn their way to a title by competing in the regular season to qualify for a seeded playoff spot. Flying knee again, Harrison hurt! Once in the playoffs, the men must survive two opponents in one night of frantic action to advance to the title fight. That's a TKO victory and a trip to New York City for Ali Isayev. The title fight winner is crowned PFL division champion and awarded $1 million. This distinctive format puts each fighter in control of their own fate. Puts him in big trouble. The 2019 playoffs delivered all the action and intrigue one could expect from the unpredictability accompanying such a unique and demanding format, where sometimes durability is the best ability. PFL Inside the Season is presented by the United States Marine Corps. Las Vegas' Mandalay Bay Resort and Casino hosted the heavyweight and light heavyweight playoffs where a new champion would be crowned in both hard-hitting divisions. Vinny Magalhaes, a former Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu world champion, was the 2018 light heavyweight championship runner-up. In the title fight, Vinny faced Sean O'Connell, who knew better than to hit the ground with Vinny. O'Connell expertly executed a winning strategy while also scoring powerful strikes. That earned O'Connell the title and landed him in the PFL announcer's booth. Magalhaes dropped his 2019 season opener to a striker and then won his second fight with a submission, qualifying him for the playoffs. In his first playoff fight, Magalhaes faces tough Russian Rashid Yusupov. Four of the eight light heavyweight playoff qualifiers are Russian. This year's competition is definitely like in a way tougher than last year. I feel like I just gotta stick with my plan because like you know when it comes to the ground game, nobody's gonna be better than me. So that's what I have to do. It's funny because like for me like last season hasn't ended yet. You know for me it's a continuation of what happened last year. I was definitely not satisfied with to just make to the final. My whole goal is to make the championship and this time get the belt and get that money. Cut to the gloves. Yusuf off the southpaw in the gray trunks. Magalhaes in the goal. Surprisingly, through the first half of the first round, Magalhaes kept his distance, landing a few kicks without pressing to take the action to the ground. Another high kick attempt there, caught by Rashid Yusupov. Then suddenly, Yusupov, a southpaw, landed a lightning-quick combo at 246 of the first, flooring Magalhaes and ending his hopes of returning to the title fight. Rashid Yusupov advances to the semifinals, and in his second fight of the night, Yusupov will face the winner of a USA-Russia showdown. In a rematch of their regular season opener, Russian Maxime Grishin and Jordan Johnson, the lone American in the light heavyweight playoffs, face off again. After losing the first encounter, Johnson made several changes to his training camp. First time that I fought Maxim, I was so lost, and when I was in the cage, I was so lost. I wasn't able to zone in. I wasn't able to get in the zone. I wasn't able to go do my thing. Had I won that fight, I don't know if I would have done the things that I've done to get here. No, I'm gonna have no issue getting into that zone and just letting my offense go. There's one of the takedowns that he's looking for, so let's see if he does the damage from top like he splits. Good job by Maxine getting back to, it, back to his feet. That was a big right hand for Jordan Johnson. There we go. Dumps Grecian to his back. Ten seconds remain here. Big right hand for Grecian. He's got Johnson in trouble here at the end of round one. A couple more punches land. Lead knee there for Grecian, and Johnson trips him to his back. One minute remains for these light heavyweights to make a case and advance to the semifinals. Front kick from Grecian. Another jab lands. Grecian wants to get with a flurry late. Johnson goes down with that last kick. In the end, the fight was scored a majority draw. So under league rules, each judge picks the fighter they thought had the most complete performance.
All three judges chose the lone American, Jordan Johnson, to advance to the semifinal, where he will face another Russian, Rashid Yusupov. Thanks everyone for being here. Let's have some fun. Let's keep that money and belt here in the States. In the top half of the bracket, the number one seed, Argentina's Emiliano Sordi, was looking like the man to beat. In Sordi's season opener, he dominated Vinny Magalesh, forcing a referee stoppage in the second round. In Sordi's second regular season fight, he avenged a 2018 playoff loss to Bozigit Atayev with a first round KO of the Russian veteran. At this event, Sordi's quarterfinal fight was against the number eight seed, New Zealand's Sigi Pasalele, who qualified for the playoffs by virtue of a walkover win. Pesalelli was on a two-fight losing streak, soon to become three, as Emiliano Sordi quickly dispatched of the overmatched Pesalelli at one minute and 13 seconds of round one. Big right hand, they have found one. Loving away with that right hand is Emiliano Sordi, and he goes to work on the body with his left leg. Siggy Pesalelli in trouble early here, and uppercut lands, and Siggy crumbles into a heap against the cage, and that will do it. Another first round knockout in quarterfinal action for Emiliano Sordi.